Well, I got this one opened up. This is the last lane that I wanted to kind of get open. Or in the disc over it, had the kids walk down it, throw all the roots and chunks and stuff like that out of it. So it looks pretty good. I'm going to, uh, I'm about to run over and disc everything with the way the disc is set right now. I want to cut it kind of deep. And then I'm going to take it and I'm going to take all the angle out of the front end and the rear and just run over it. And then we're going to seed this big lane over there. We're going to get it seeded out. And then we're going to, well, I've got uh, lime and fertilizer and the seed I'm going to put on it too, which is just soybeans and let it go. And the uh, lime will hit it just right for this fall and just let it do what it's going to do and let it set the rest of the rest, you know, rest of summer here. Let's take us a ride over this cornfield. There's a uh, irrigation pivot right up here in front of me. I already checked it to make sure I could clear it. Hopefully it'll still clear it when I, because I am running wide open at it right now. So we're going to, there's a the pivot, bam, right over it. Good deal, I'm 20 feet off the ground. So we're gonna go this is a very long field too, I mean, this is corn. This it, uh, drone's flying at 31 miles an hour, 1800 feet right now, 19, 2000. So we are rolling, still at 20 feet off the ground, 31 miles an hour, wind's blowing pretty good. You see these perfect rows planted off of a uh, GPS. Let's see, uh, 3,100 feet. We still ain't quite to the end of it yet. We're gonna make us a loop down here as we close in here. We're at 38. We're gonna turn her here a little bit. Wide open, 4,000 feet. Yep, 
you can really tell how fast the drone's going when I when you see the the ground right there below it like that. That's cool looking right there. All the way back. Takes a little bit to fly that far like it. Even at 30 miles an hour. We're at 1,800 feet. 31, a little better than 31 miles an hour. So we're two, Two minutes and 40 seconds in on this. There's the pivot. Right there. You can see the pivot track. I can hear the drones about 700 feet. Ooh, did y'all see that? It's got a, uh, that's pretty cool. They got a little bridge right here. I just seen it. For the pivot to cross on. See that? That's pretty slick. It's amazing the stuff that you can see. See where the pivot comes right through there? Crosses the drainage. And keeps right on rolling, man. A lot of corn out there growing. Another road and drainage. Oh, that is the road. Okay. Let's not hit that tree. There's a restricted space right here behind me. <coughs> and <coughs> it'll it's like a geo wall right there. When you fly up against it, it'll just there's that drainage itch. It, uh, the drone will just completely stop on it. Won't let you go no further. So that's pretty slick. I just wanted to fly this wide open like this right here. So we'll run this pivot right here. This pivot is long too, man. This old drone's bad as bone, man. It's got all kind of radar on it here. Drop her back down a little bit. So right there is where it starts at, where the pivot is right there. So there's a pump. Very cool. So this is what the whole field looks like up all the way up in there. You can see the uh, pivot marks or the wheels for it tracks right there in the field.
because it just makes a complete circle. We're gonna bring her back. 